What's going on guys? Captain Sharky fresh off the boat with some amazing kiddos and we caught a ton of sheep's head. And so these guys are absolutely awesome to eat, but one of the most misunderstood species as far as the ability to fillet these things. A lot of people think it's really, really hard. So I'm here to show you an easy way how to fillet this sheep's head. It's actually one of the easiest inshore fishes to fillet, in my opinion, when done properly. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make an incision right here about an inch behind its gill plate. And we're gonna go about halfway down the fish here. And the reason being is these sheep's head have a really, really big rib cage right here. So versus trying to cut all the way through it, we're gonna avoid it completely. First cuts here, about halfway down the fish. I turn the, turn the sheep's head like this and you can actually feel that main bone here where the rib cage starts. I'm gonna place a knife right to the right of that. I don't want to be inside its rib cage. I want to be right outside. I'm going to start working the knife down. I'm going to work it down all the way to this bottom anal fin right here, just like so. Now that I've done that, I can turn the sheep's head and insert the knife in my original cut here. And basically work down this fin line, just like so. And so, Similar to a flounder, you kind of just press down along that inner rib cage there and work your way down the meat, just like so, until you can get a good grab and start cutting down the fish. And then the final cut, right through here, and just like that. All right, so. Now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Our first cut's about an inch behind this, uh, that hard breather there. And just like this, turn the fish, make our cut around the rib cage, down to that back anal fin. Now this one I do a little bit differently because I'm not right-handed. You could, I mean, I am right-handed. You could enter and do the same thing down, but this just seems to be easier for me, so. I basically stick the knife in for my last cutting point here and press down, make sure that I'm riding this, this line on the inside of the fish and basically do the exact same thing. Use this thumb to peel the meat up and work my way all the way until we can poke the knife through, slide down real nice and easy. Same thing on this side, poke the knife through and just like that so we've got two nice fish fillets here a lot of people like to leave these on the half shell and cook them on the grill just like a red fish all right now we're going to do it fast just to show you guys how how fast this method can be here here we go and once you get the hang of it this is actually one of the easiest fish to lay in shore. And one of the best eating, actually. The meat on a sheep's head is pure white and very delicious. And just like that, the sheep's head is completely done and ready to rock. A lot of you guys are thinking, man, you're missing a lot of meat here. Well, let me show you the hard way to fillet them, and we're gonna compare the fillets. So you know, so cutting all the way down now. We're gonna cut through the whole rib cage, which is extra hard, but just to show you guys, All right, so let's take this fillet and this fillet, and you actually can see that by avoiding that rib cage here, you're not missing out on anything. This all right here is just bones from the rib. And so by avoiding that main rib cage and cutting around it in your initial cut will save you time, energy, effort, and make for a much faster fillet. Absolutely beautiful, ready to wash off and grill. Ow!